Hey everyone, what's going on? Phoenix here, bringing you another Asheron Skull gameplay video. Today we are back at the Rinthid Infested Plains, or the Rinthid Encampment, and we are going to be doing a Lugian Assault. So, in order to flag for this quest, you need to speak with the only Lugian in the camp, Roxa, who will give you a sealed scroll for Commander Presk. From here, we are going to run to Presk's Bunker which is located uh, kind of on the far side of the uh, Rinthid Infested Plain. So um, you can run directly through the plains, through the dangerous <laughs> Rinthid area. A lot of times on Levistress, the way we run this quest is we finish Rinthid Tentacle Weapons. And from the surface portal for Rinthid Tentacle Weapons, you can just jump down pretty close to Presk's Bunker. So it makes a good quest chain to do Rinthid Tentacle Weapons, then Lugian Assault, and then from there, uh, the End of Days quest, which I'm gonna be doing a separate walkthrough for. Um, but yeah, this quest is restricted to 180 plus, uh, which makes sense. It's you know part of the Rinthid Infested Plains quests, which are all you know 180 plus at least. The rewards are 500 million experience, which is a fixed amount of experience, and 20,000 luminance, and a casting stone, which I'm not a war mage, so I don't actually know if it's good, but it uh, it has bludgeon, bludgeon rending built in, and legendary willpower, legendary war magic, biting strike and resistance cleaving bludgeoning. So maybe a, a good opening bludgeon rend for a, a war mage. But anyway, we are getting close to, I should have put my go arrow on pointing at the right thing so that you can see the way I'm running. So yeah, it's the same type of like Lugian wall that you find uh, next to Path of the Blind outside of Eastwatch, if you're familiar with that. So it's, you know, it's kind of obvious that this is the Lugian one that you're going after. The drop is safe, so it's a good place to kind of gather your group if uh, anybody gets lost outside or anything. You're going to head east out from the drop. And basically, there's going to be these large rooms where there's going to be stones, rinthed stones falling from the ceiling that kind of explode, as you can see. And those hit you for a ton of damage. So if you're bludgeon bold, I highly recommend using a dispel gem. One thing to note, if you run through the center of these rooms, the room will cast a bludgeon bolt on you. There are traps everywhere. So the way that I recommend doing is running around the outside, or if you have a high enough jump skill, you can jump over the room. That's only if somebody else is pulling the levers for you. If you're pulling the levers yourself, obviously you're gonna run around the edge anyway. So in the first room, it's this Northwest lever. Each room, obviously they, there's a, a few levers to make it kind of tough. At the T, we're gonna go right. In the second room, we're gonna pull the Southwest lever. So that's this first lever on the right. run through it basically opens the door at the end of the room the lugians in here um they do hurt they do have hollow weapons but it's not that bad the third room i believe the wiki says it's this middle lever but i don't actually think that that works oh yes it does okay so this is the one that's correct anyway third room middle lever on the left run through there's a whole bunch of lugians fourth room also says it's the second lever, and I think it's the third one. So this fourth room is wrong on the wiki. It's the last lever on the left. All right, fifth room, we're going for a northwest. So second lever on the right. And sixth room, I think it's the same lever. Northeast lever but that's also the second lever on the right. Oh, did I miss it? I pulled the wrong one. I think I pulled the first lever on the right. It's the second lever on the right. 
All right, and once you've gone through all the rooms, you'll come to this Presk's Treasury Portal. The drop for this is hot, and it's this is actually going to be a little bit tough for me to solo, but we're going to go for it anyway. So the only thing you have to kill in this room is Captain Keysong. Who will drop a key to that door over there to the northwest. This is one of the few good uses in the game for your uh, lightning rending weapons. For your lightning wasps. These guys hit hard, especially when they're all on you. Well, I'm evading them right now, which is nice. But yeah, I just got hit for 100 twice in a row. got him dead we're gonna loot uh treasury key i'm gonna run over unlock this door go through this door opens on its own jump across the pit and then we're gonna hand our sealed scroll for commander presk to commander presk and from there we can just recall to the rent and encampment after you recall we're just gonna turn directly to the left and hand our scroll to Roxa for our rewards. So that's it, 21,000 luminance, 500 million experience and eight trade notes. That fight at the end is very tough to solo, so I do recommend coming in a group. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please press that like button, please subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching. Bye.